Have you ever found yourself forcing situations, trying to control the uncontrollable, only to feel frustrated and exhausted in the end? The truth is, we live in a society that teaches us to fight against the current, to insist to never give up. But what if I told you that this path only leads to emotional and mental exhaustion? It seems counterintuitive, but sometimes the best strategy is simply not to force anything. There is a profound wisdom in knowing when to let go, when to let life take its natural course. After all, forcing something that isn't meant to be is like trying to plant a tree in the desert. On this journey, you'll discover how Stoicism, an ancient philosophy, can offer valuable lessons to find peace and purpose without the need to push something that isn't flowing. Are you curious to know how? Stick with me and let's explore this powerful approach together. Topic 1. Live fully in the present. Imagine a wise person sitting under an ancient tree, whispering secrets that time has taught them. They would tell you that the true power of life lies in living now, as the present is the only time we truly possess. By focusing completely on the present moment, we set aside worries about what might happen. Have you ever noticed how children live each second intensely, as if every moment were an adventure? That's the secret that Stoics understand so well. And you? Have you been paying attention to the present, or do you lose yourself in anxieties about the future? To truly understand Stoicism and Stoic philosophy, one must dive into the practice of living in the present. Have you heard of mindfulness? It's not just a passing trend, but a practice deeply rooted in ancient philosophies, including Stoicism. A simple example is during a meal, instead of devouring your food while thinking about a thousand things, try to savor every flavor, every texture. The modern Stoic practices this, finding peace in the small things that many let slip by. When was the last time you really savored a moment? If there is one Stoic lesson that can transform your life, it is to constantly question yourself, what is happening now? This not only reduces stress, but also brings you closer to who you truly are. The Stoic philosophy of life teaches that by focusing on the present, we become emotionally stronger. After all, what we have now is all that truly matters. Personal development starts here, in this moment. How about starting to apply this practice today? Living in the present also means deeply engaging with the environment around you. Imagine walking through a park and really noticing the beauty of the trees, feeling the wind on your face, hearing the birds sing. It seems simple, but it's a powerful practice that can change your perception of life. Many get lost in their own minds, but the Stoic knows that true peace lies in connecting with the now. When was the last time you allowed yourself this connection? And if living in the present were the key to true happiness, think about it. Anxiety and stress often arise when we worry about the future or dwell on the past. But modern Stoicism teaches us that by focusing on the now, we can find genuine joy in simple things. Perhaps you've already experienced this without realizing it, like a moment of peace amidst chaos. So why not seek more of these moments? Living in the present is a daily practice, almost a discipline. It's not something you do once and forget. Every morning when you wake up, make a pact with yourself to make the most of the day ahead. If Stoic philosophy teaches us anything, it is that life is precious and fleeting. Every moment is a gift, and it's up to you to make the most of it. So are you ready to embrace the present with all your being? Topic 2. Understand the impermanence of life. Imagine a river flowing gently, its waters never the same, always changing, always moving forward. Life is like that, constantly in motion, never stopping. Stoicism teaches us that this impermanence is the only certainty we have. 
By accepting that everything is temporary, from our moments of happiness to our deepest pains, we can start to live more lightly, more resiliently. Stoic philosophy invites us to embrace this truth, not with sadness, but with a deep understanding that everything is part of the natural cycle of life. And you, how do you deal with the inevitable changes life brings? To truly comprehend impermanence, think of nature, see the seasons change, the leaves falling in autumn, making way for renewal in spring. The modern Stoic learns from these lessons of nature, accepting that everything has a beginning and an end. This doesn't mean we should be apathetic or indifferent, but that we should value each moment for what it is. By recognizing that our emotions, whether joy or sorrow, are fleeting, we become emotionally stronger. How about starting to view life through this stoic lens? The stoic philosophy of life teaches us that impermanence can be a source of great wisdom. When we realize that nothing lasts forever, we begin to value what we have now. This understanding helps us focus on what really matters, letting go of unnecessary worries and anxieties. As the Stoics say, by understanding impermanence, you free yourself from the fear of the unknown. Imagine how your life could change if you adopted this perspective. Are you prepared to live with more gratitude and less attachment? Accepting impermanence also allows us to face difficulties with more courage and serenity. Knowing that even the hardest moments will pass, we find the strength to move forward. The Stoic sees adversity as part of the natural flow of life, something to be faced with dignity and calm. Think of how many times you've overcome challenges that seemed insurmountable. Isn't that proof that everything eventually passes? Acceptance is a powerful tool. How can you apply it to your daily struggles? This Stoic understanding is not about resignation, but about wisdom. When we understand that everything is impermanent, we become more patient and compassionate, both with ourselves and with others. Every person who crosses our path, every situation we face, is there for a limited time. Knowing this helps us act with more diligence and less haste, appreciating the life lessons that arise at every turn. Have you been practicing patience amidst life's changes? Living with the awareness of impermanence makes us more grateful. Instead of lamenting what was or fearing what will be, we can focus on what we have now, at this very moment. Stoic philosophy invites us to cultivate this gratitude daily, for it is what allows us to live more harmoniously and happily. How about starting each day with gratitude for the small things? After all, as the Stoics teach, it is in simplicity that we find true wealth. What can you be thankful for today? Topic 3. The Power of Acceptance Imagine yourself in the middle of a storm. The winds howl, the waves crash violently, but at the center of the storm there is a place of calm. This is where Stoic acceptance resides. Stoic philosophy teaches us that although we cannot control life's storms, we can always choose how we respond to them. Acceptance is not giving up, but recognizing what is beyond our control and redirecting our energies to what truly matters. Think of how many times you have fought against the inevitable, only to discover that peace lay in accepting the situation. And have you found this inner calm amidst life's storms? Acceptance in Stoicism is like a compass guiding us through challenges. When we understand that not everything is under our control, we release the weight of expectations and frustrations. This doesn't mean abandoning our dreams or goals, but adjusting our vision and efforts to what is within our reach. Imagine a stoic archer who, after shooting the arrow, can no longer control its course, only accepts the result with serenity. That's the beauty of acceptance. Are you ready to adjust your internal compass and focus on what you can truly influence? By practicing acceptance, we begin to realize that many of our negative emotions, like anger or fear, arise from trying to control the uncontrollable. The Stoic philosophy of life reminds us that we can choose our battles. When we accept that certain things are beyond our reach, we free up mental and emotional space to focus on our true priorities. Imagine the freedom that comes from letting go of what cannot be changed. How would your life be if you started practicing this acceptance today? But acceptance is not synonymous with passivity. 
Stoicism teaches that even in the midst of acceptance, we must continue to act with diligence and courage. The difference is that now we act with clarity, knowing that we have done our best within the circumstances given to us. Like a wise person who, when faced with a difficult situation, accepts reality and instead of despairing, finds the strength to move forward. Have you experienced this strength that comes from conscious acceptance? And there is incredible power in accepting the flaws and imperfections of life. Stoic acceptance allows us to see the beauty in the imperfect, the wisdom in difficulties, and the opportunity in every obstacle. This perspective makes us more resilient and able to face adversity with a calm and confident spirit. Imagine the peace that can come from accepting life as it is, without the burden of unrealistic expectations. Are you prepared to embrace this vision and turn challenges into opportunities? Acceptance brings us invaluable freedom. When we stop resisting life's currents and instead navigate with them, we find a path of less suffering and more clarity. The modern Stoic knows that true strength lies in accepting without clinging to what could have been, but rather to what is. This daily practice of acceptance is one of the keys to a full and meaningful life. Are you ready to start practicing this liberating acceptance? Topic four, learn to let go. Imagine you are carrying a backpack full of rocks. Each rock represents a negative emotion, a worry, or something beyond your control. The more you carry this backpack, the heavier it becomes, making life's journey increasingly difficult. Stoicism teaches us that to live fully, we need to learn to let go. Letting go of these rocks is not easy, but it is essential to finding peace and contentment. By practicing this philosophy, you free yourself from unnecessary weight and begin to walk more lightly. Are you ready to empty your backpack? Letting go does not mean giving up or becoming indifferent. On the contrary, it means being selective about where we place our energy and attention. Imagine a gardener who, upon realizing a plant is dying, decides to remove the dead leaves to make room for new growth. This is the essence of letting go in Stoicism. By abandoning what no longer serves you, you create space for what truly matters in your life. Have you identified the areas where you need to let go to allow for new growth? The modern Stoic understands that clinging to what is beyond our control only brings suffering. Imagine trying to hold sand in your hands. The more you squeeze, the more it slips away. That's how it is with things we try to control without success. Letting go is opening your hands and allowing life to follow its natural course. When we do this, we experience an emotional freedom that allows us to live more fully. Have you ever felt the relief of letting go of something that was weighing you down? On the path of personal development, Letting go is an essential skill. Often we hold on to ideas, people or situations that no longer serve us out of fear or attachment to the past. But Stoic philosophy invites us to look to the future with courage, knowing that letting go is an act of wisdom, not weakness. By practicing this Stoic lesson, you open doors to new opportunities and experiences. How can you start applying this wisdom in your life today? Moreover, letting go also involves emotional detachment. Emotions, like life's events, are temporary. Stoicism teaches us to observe our emotions without being dominated by them, allowing them to flow and leave when the time comes. By learning to let go, we cultivate a stronger and more resilient mind, capable of facing life's challenges with serenity. Are you ready to let go of your negative emotions and make room for a calm mind? By learning to let go, you become more present in the here and now. Without the weight of the past or anxiety about the future, your mind becomes clearer and more focused. This practice is one of the keys to living a more conscious and fulfilling life. Stoicism teaches us that by releasing what we cannot control, we find true freedom. Are you willing to let go of what is holding you back from living fully?
Topic 5. Practice mindfulness. Imagine your mind as a lake. When it is agitated, the waters become murky and it is difficult to see what lies beneath the surface. Mindfulness in Stoicism is like calming these waters, allowing you to see your thoughts and emotions clearly without judgment. By practicing mindfulness, you take control of your mind instead of being swept away by currents of worries and distractions. The modern Stoic knows that this control is essential for facing life's challenges with clarity and serenity. Have you been practicing mindfulness in your daily life? For the Stoic, mindfulness is not just a meditative practice, but a way of life. Imagine being fully present in every task, from the simplest, like washing dishes, to the most complex, like making an important decision. By being fully aware of every action and thought, you reduce stress and increase your ability to respond to challenges with wisdom. Stoic philosophy teaches us that mindfulness is the key to living in the present, where true peace resides. How can you start applying this practice to your daily activities? Mindfulness also involves being aware of your emotions without letting them take control. Imagine a surfer who, instead of being knocked down by the waves, learns to ride them, maintaining balance. Similarly, by observing your emotions with mindfulness, you learn to navigate through them without being overwhelmed. Stoicism teaches us that by practicing this conscious observation, we develop a stronger and more resilient mind capable of facing any situation with calmness. And how have you been dealing with your emotions lately? To practice mindfulness, the modern Stoic can incorporate simple techniques like deep breathing. Imagine that as you inhale, you bring in clarity, and as you exhale, you release tension and worries. This exercise, though simple, can have a profound impact on your ability to concentrate and stay calm. Stoic philosophy values these small practices because they help us keep our minds focused and better handle adversities. Have you tried using breathing as a tool to calm your mind? Mindfulness also extends to interactions with others. Imagine being in a conversation where you are fully present, actively listening without being distracted by your own thoughts. This practice not only strengthens your relationships, but also helps you respond more consciously and less reactively. Stoicism teaches us that by practicing mindfulness in our interactions, we cultivate a deeper and more authentic connection with the people around us. How would it be if you applied this practice in your next conversations? Mindfulness in Stoicism is about finding peace in the present, regardless of external circumstances. By cultivating this practice, you become less vulnerable to external influences and more centered in your own being. The Stoic knows that by mastering the art of mindfulness, they can face any challenge with a clear mind and a tranquil heart. Are you ready to start this journey of self-mastery and serenity? Topic 6. Use silence effectively. Imagine silence as a wise counselor, always present but rarely heard. In Stoicism, silence is not just the absence of words but a powerful opportunity for introspection and clarity. By cultivating silence, you create a space where you can hear your inner voice and connect with your true needs and desires. This practice is essential for making wise decisions and maintaining peace amidst chaos. The modern Stoic values silence as an invaluable resource for personal growth and deep self-understanding. Have you given space to silence in your life? Silence can be a tool for self-reflection, allowing you to analyze your actions and thoughts without distractions. Imagine being in a dark room where every sound becomes more distinct. Similarly, in moments of silence, your thoughts and feelings become clearer, allowing you to examine them with a renewed perspective. Stoic philosophy teaches us that by doing this regularly, we can develop a deeper understanding of our own patterns of behavior and emotions. How would it be if you reserved daily time for this kind of silent reflection? Furthermore, silence has the power to calm the mind and restore emotional balance. Imagine your mind as a glass of cloudy water. Silence is the time needed for the water to settle and clarity to return. 
In a world full of noise and constant distractions, finding moments of silence is essential to maintaining a calm and focused mind. Stoicism reminds us that it is in this space of silence that we find our true strength and resilience. How can you integrate more moments of silence into your routine? Silence is also a practice of self-control. Imagine being in a heated discussion, but instead of reacting impulsively, you choose silence. That moment of pause might be what prevents words you might regret later. The Stoic knows that silence, when used effectively, can be more powerful than any verbal argument. It allows you to respond with wisdom instead of reacting with emotion. And how have you used silence in challenging situations? Beyond being a personal tool, silence can enrich your interactions with others. Imagine listening to someone without interrupting, allowing them to finish their thoughts completely. This attentive silence creates a space of respect and mutual understanding, strengthening your relationships. Stoic philosophy teaches us that by valuing silence in conversations, we show respect and empathy for others, creating deeper connections. Have you experienced the positive impact of silence in your conversations? Silence is a doorway to introspection and inner wisdom. In Stoicism, it is seen as a path to true understanding of oneself and the world around us. By dedicating time to silence, you allow your mind to explore new ideas and perceptions that might not arise amidst daily noise and hustle. The modern Stoic knows that it is in silence that many of the deepest answers can be found. Are you willing to explore the riches that silence can offer? Topic 7. Appreciate the journey, not just the destination. Imagine yourself climbing a mountain. Every step is a challenge, every breath an effort, but the view along the way is spectacular. Stoic philosophy teaches us to value each step of this journey instead of focusing only on the summit. Often, we become so obsessed with the final outcome that we forget to appreciate the learning and growth that occur along the way. The modern Stoic understands that true satisfaction comes from fully engaging in the process. And have you appreciated the journey, or are you only focused on the destination? Appreciate every small progress as a victory. Imagine that your life is a series of marathons, and every mile covered, regardless of speed, is an achievement. Stoicism teaches us that every step, no matter how small, is important. This mindset reduces pressure and anxiety, allowing you to enjoy the process of growth and learning. Instead of worrying about how far you still need to go, celebrate how far you've already come. How can you start applying this perspective to your daily goals? The journey is where true transformation happens. Think of a sculptor who, blow by blow, shapes a rough stone into a work of art. The value lies not only in the final piece, but in every moment of dedication and effort along the way. The Stoic knows that it is during the journey that we develop resilience, patience, and wisdom. When you focus on the process instead of fixating on the outcome, you find more joy and purpose in each day. How would your life be if you began to value the process more than the final goal? Additionally, focusing on the journey teaches us to be more present and attentive. Imagine that while walking through a garden, you are so focused on reaching the other side that you don't notice the flowers around you. Similarly, by focusing only on the results, we miss the beauty of the experiences we encounter along the way. Stoic philosophy reminds us to slow down and really live each moment instead of just passing through them. What have you missed in your own journey by being so focused on the destination? When we value the journey, every challenge becomes an opportunity for growth. Think of obstacles as precious stones scattered along the way, waiting to be discovered and polished. Every difficulty overcome is a lesson learned, every mistake a chance to improve. The modern Stoic understands that the value of life lies in the Stoic lessons acquired along the way, not just in the trophies we eventually collect. Are you ready to start seeing challenges as an essential part of your journey? By appreciating the journey, 
you discover that the final result is merely a natural consequence of your constant effort. The destination stops being an obsession and becomes an additional reward. Stoic philosophy teaches that when you dedicate yourself to the process, the result takes care of itself. This brings lasting peace and satisfaction because you know you did your best at every stage. And are you willing to focus more on the journey and less on the results? Topic 8. Find joy in the simplest things. Imagine a quiet morning where the aroma of fresh coffee fills the air and the warmth of the cup in your hands brings a sense of comfort. It is in these small moments that Stoicism teaches us to find true joy. In a world that often values the grandiose and spectacular, Stoic philosophy invites us to rediscover the beauty and satisfaction in the simple things of life. The modern Stoic knows that happiness is not in great achievements, but in the small pleasures that often go unnoticed. Have you found joy in the simple things of your daily life? Appreciate the sunset, a sincere smile, or the sound of rain tapping on the window. These are examples of what Stoics would call daily treasures small gifts that life offers us at no cost. When we stop to value these simple things, we realize that true wealth is not in material possessions, but in the ability to enjoy what we already have. The Stoic philosophy of life teaches us that by focusing on these small joys, we cultivate a life of contentment and gratitude. How can you start appreciating the small moments in your life more? Moreover, finding joy in the simple things helps us reduce the desire for excess. Imagine living in a constant state of satisfaction, where you are not incessantly chasing the next big prize, but instead feeling grateful for what you already have. The modern Stoic practices this discipline of contentment, knowing that excess and the endless pursuit of more only bring anxiety and dissatisfaction. When you learn to rejoice in what is simple, you discover that life becomes lighter and richer. How would your life be if you slowed down and started appreciating more of what you already have? This approach also protects us from envy and comparison. By valuing simple things, we stop measuring our success by others' achievements and start focusing on our own happiness. Imagine a bird that doesn't worry about having the biggest tree but is content with the nest it built. Similarly, the Stoic finds peace by focusing on their own small achievements and joys without being shaken by what others have. Are you ready to free yourself from comparisons and focus more on your own joys? The practice of finding joy in simple things also strengthens gratitude, an essential quality for a harmonious life. When we start to see the value in the small things, like a good book or a pleasant conversation, our outlook on life transforms. Stoicism teaches us that gratitude is the path to a calmer mind and a more satisfied heart. By cultivating this practice, you not only improve your own life, but also spread positivity around you. How can you incorporate more gratitude into your daily routine? By finding joy in the simple things, you discover that true happiness is accessible at any moment, anywhere. You don't need to wait for big events or achievements to feel happy. Stoicism shows us that life can be incredibly rich and satisfying when we learn to value what really matters. Are you willing to start seeking joy in the small things and live a fuller and more rewarding life? Topic 9. The Art of Gratitude Imagine opening your eyes in the morning and before anything else, you're thankful just for being alive. Stoic philosophy teaches us that gratitude is a powerful practice that transforms how we see the world and how we relate to it. Being grateful for the small and large things helps us focus on what we have instead of dwelling on what we lack. The modern Stoic understands that by cultivating gratitude, they develop a strong and resilient mind capable of facing adversities with a lighter heart. Have you been practicing gratitude daily? Gratitude is not just a beautiful word, it is a practice that requires effort and constant attention. Imagine a farmer who tends to their land every day, watering the plants and removing the weeds. Similarly, gratitude needs to be cultivated day after day until it becomes an integral part of your being. 
Stoicism teaches us that by recognizing and appreciating the small blessings in life, like a good meal or a gesture of kindness, we change our perspective and live more fully. How can you start cultivating gratitude in your daily life? The practice of gratitude also strengthens our emotional resilience. Imagine a shield that grows stronger with each thank you, becoming more resistant to adversity. When we are grateful, we are less likely to be knocked down by difficulties because our mind is focused on what is positive and constructive. Stoic philosophy reminds us that even in the toughest situations, there is always something to be thankful for, and this perspective gives us the strength to keep going. How have you used gratitude to face life's challenges? Additionally, gratitude helps us create and maintain healthier and more meaningful relationships. Imagine a bridge that connects you to the people around you, built with each act of recognition and thankfulness. By expressing gratitude regularly, we not only strengthen our bonds, but also create an environment of mutual support and understanding. Stoicism teaches us that by valuing others and showing our gratitude, we build a support network that sustains us in times of need. How can you express more gratitude to the important people in your life? Practicing gratitude also helps us maintain an open mind and a balanced perspective. When we are thankful for what we have, we become less vulnerable to the incessant desire for more. Imagine walking along a path where instead of focusing on what is missing, you appreciate every step, every view along the way. This is the essence of stoic gratitude, which invites us to be content with what life offers us without losing sight of the importance of growth and improvement. Are you ready to embrace this practice and see the difference it can make in your life? The art of gratitude is about recognizing that each day is an opportunity to be happy with what we already have. Stoicism reminds us that life is short and precious, and by expressing gratitude, we honor this truth. By practicing gratitude, we find an inner peace that does not depend on external circumstances, but rather on an internal decision to value what is truly important. Are you willing to start this transformative practice today? Topic 10. Appreciate solitude. Imagine a quiet night where the only company is the soft sound of the wind and your own thoughts. In Stoicism, solitude is not seen as painful isolation, but as an opportunity for deep self-reflection and personal growth. Being alone allows you to connect with yourself in a way that is hard to achieve in the constant company of others. The modern Stoic values solitude as a sacred space to reorganize thoughts, realign goals and find clarity. Have you taken advantage of solitude to better understand yourself? For Stoics, solitude is like a mirror that reflects your true essence without the distortions caused by others' expectations and opinions. Imagine being in a vast desert where there are no distractions, just you and your thoughts. This space allows you to explore your deepest emotions and values without external interference. Stoic philosophy teaches us that by embracing solitude, we develop a clearer understanding of who we truly are and what we really want. How can you start using solitude as a tool for self-knowledge? Additionally, solitude is an opportunity to strengthen emotional self-sufficiency. Imagine your mind as a garden, and in solitude you have the freedom to tend to it without rush, planting the seeds of thoughts and feelings you wish to cultivate. The Stoic knows that by relying less on external validations and more on their own judgment, they find an unshakable source of strength and contentment. Solitude then becomes not a punishment, but a gift, a chance to nurture your mind and soul. How have you cultivated your self-sufficiency in moments of solitude? Solitude also offers a space for creativity to flourish. Imagine an artist before a blank canvas where every stroke is born from introspection and silence. When we are alone, away from the noise of the world, our minds have the freedom to wander, to explore new ideas and perspectives that may have been suppressed amidst the hustle and bustle of everyday life. Stoicism values these moments of solitude as essential for personal development and the authentic expression of who we are. 
Have you experienced the brilliant ideas that can emerge in moments of silence and solitude? Moreover, learning to appreciate solitude helps us build a healthier relationship with ourselves. Imagine being your own best friend, capable of enjoying your own company without feeling lonely or incomplete. The modern Stoic understands that by being comfortable with themselves, they become more emotionally independent and more capable of facing life's challenges with serenity. Solitude then transforms into a tool for personal empowerment. How would your life be if you learned to value your own company more? Solitude offers us the chance to reassess our priorities and goals away from external pressures. When we are alone, we have the opportunity to ask ourselves what really matters without the influence of others. Stoicism teaches us that this time of reflection is crucial for a well-lived life, where decisions are made from a deep understanding of oneself, not from social expectations. Are you ready to embrace solitude as an ally on your path to personal growth? Topic 11. Cultivate a tranquil mind. Imagine being in the eye of a hurricane where everything around you is chaotic, but you are at peace, undisturbed. Stoic philosophy teaches us that this mental tranquility is the foundation of a balanced and happy life. Cultivating a tranquil mind means learning to separate what is under our control from what is not. By focusing only on what we can influence, we release unnecessary anxiety and stress. The modern Stoic knows that a tranquil mind is like an anchor amidst life's storms. And how have you been working to keep your mind at peace? A tranquil mind does not arise by chance. It is the result of practice and discipline. Imagine a lake, initially agitated by strong winds, but with time and patience, it calms until its surface is as smooth as a mirror. Similarly, by practicing the separation of what we can and cannot control, our mind gradually quiets down. Stoic philosophy of life reminds us that it's not about being indifferent, but about adopting a serene attitude in the face of challenges. How can you start applying this practice to your daily life? Cultivating a tranquil mind also involves regularly questioning yourself. Is this under my control? Imagine a gardener who only tends to the plants in their garden without worrying about the weeds in the neighboring field. The Stoic understands that focusing on what is beyond our reach only brings frustration and emotional exhaustion. When you learn to concentrate your energies on what you can truly influence, inner peace becomes more accessible. Are you ready to start asking this crucial question in your daily decisions? Moreover, a tranquil mind is like a fortress against emotional storms. Imagine that every time you face a challenging situation, you have the option to react with calmness or agitation. The Stoic chooses calmness, knowing that a tranquil mind is clearer and more capable of making better decisions. By cultivating this tranquility, you become more resilient, able to face adversity without being swept away by negative emotions. How would your life be if you adopted this approach in your moments of crisis? This practice of maintaining a tranquil mind does not mean ignoring problems, but rather addressing them more effectively. Imagine an experienced sailor who upon seeing a storm approaching does not panic, but prepares calmly and with determination. Stoicism teaches us that by maintaining serenity, we can navigate challenges better without being overwhelmed by fear or anger. And how have you prepared your mind to face life's difficulties? A tranquil mind is the path to a fuller and more satisfying life. When we stop worrying about what we cannot control, we find more space for joy, gratitude and creativity. Stoic philosophy invites us to practice this tranquility daily as a way of living more consciously and balanced. Are you willing to cultivate this inner peace that can transform your life? Topic 12. Value Self-Sufficiency Imagine a sturdy tree in the middle of an open field whose roots are so deep that it can withstand the fiercest storms. This tree is like the modern Stoic who values self-sufficiency and finds strength within themselves. 
Regardless of external circumstances, Stoic philosophy teaches us that true security and happiness come from within, not from the things or people around us. Being self-sufficient means seeking within yourself the source of peace and contentment instead of relying on what is temporary and unstable. Have you found this inner strength? Self-sufficiency is not synonymous with isolation, but with emotional independence. Imagine being on a ship at sea with all the tools necessary to navigate without external assistance. The modern Stoic carries within them the tools of discipline, resilience, and wisdom, which allow them to face any challenge with confidence. By valuing self-sufficiency, you become less vulnerable to external influences and more capable of maintaining your serenity no matter what happens. How can you start strengthening your emotional self-sufficiency? Self. Sufficiency is also related to the ability to find contentment in your own abilities and achievements. Imagine a craftsman who, with their own hands, creates something beautiful and lasting. This feeling of accomplishment and satisfaction comes from within, from knowing that you are capable of facing challenges and achieving goals on your own. Stoicism teaches us that by valuing self-sufficiency, we develop a sense of purpose and self-esteem that does not depend on external approval. And how can you start recognizing and valuing your own capabilities more? Moreover, by being self-sufficient, you reduce dependence on factors beyond your control. Imagine a fortress that, because it is self-sufficient in its resources, does not fear siege. Similarly, when you seek strength and happiness within yourself, you become less susceptible to the fluctuations and uncertainties of the external world. Stoicism reminds us that by cultivating self-sufficiency, we become more resilient and less likely to fall into despair when things don't go as planned. How would your life be if you depended less on external circumstances to be happy? Self-sufficiency also invites us to value simplicity and be at peace with what we have. Imagine a wise person who, in their small cabin, finds more joy and peace than many who possess great riches. The Stoic knows that true happiness is not in material abundance, but in the ability to find contentment in what is essential. By valuing self-sufficiency, you discover that life can be full and satisfying with less, as long as what you have comes from within. How can you start simplifying your life and focusing more on what is truly important? Valuing self-sufficiency is an act of personal empowerment. When you trust in your own abilities and find strength within yourself, you become less dependent on external expectations and pressures. Stoicism teaches us that this independence is the key to a more balanced and happy life. By cultivating self-sufficiency, you become the captain of your own soul, navigating safely through any storm. Are you ready to start valuing your self-sufficiency more and live a fuller and more authentic life? Topic 13. Practice compassion and empathy. Imagine being in someone else's shoes, feeling their joys and pains as if they were your own. Although often associated with personal resilience, Stoic philosophy also places great emphasis on the practice of compassion and empathy. Being emotionally strong does not mean being indifferent to others' struggles, but rather having the ability to offer genuine support without judgment. The modern Stoic understands that by practicing compassion, they not only strengthen themselves, but also the people around them, creating an environment of harmony and understanding. And how have you exercised compassion in your daily life? Practicing compassion begins with empathy, the ability to truly understand what someone else is going through. Imagine a bridge that connects you to someone else's heart allowing you to see the world through their eyes. The Stoic values this connection, knowing that everyone faces their own battles, often invisible.
By practicing empathy, you not only offer a friendly shoulder, but also strengthen your own values and principles. Stoic philosophy teaches us that by helping others, we also help ourselves as we create a kinder and more supportive world. How can you start being more empathetic in your daily interactions? Compassion and empathy also connect us to our shared humanity. Imagine a circle that encompasses all of us, where each person, regardless of their differences, is part of a greater whole. Stoicism reminds us that deep down, we all share the same basic desires, happiness, security, and peace. By practicing compassion, we recognize this truth and become agents of positive change offering support and understanding where it is most needed. How would your life be if you adopted this perspective of unity and connection? Moreover, the practice of compassion strengthens our relationships. Imagine that each act of kindness and empathy is a seed planted in fertile soil, which over time grows and blooms, making your connections deeper and more meaningful. The modern Stoic understands that by practicing compassion, they build a network of mutual support that enriches both their life and those around them. Stoic philosophy teaches us that by giving, we also receive, as compassion creates bonds of trust and respect. How can you start planting more of these seeds in your relationships? Practicing compassion also makes us more aware of others' struggles and less quick to judge. Imagine that instead of criticizing, you choose to understand and support. Stoicism reminds us that we are all imperfect and that instead of pointing out others' flaws, we should seek to help them overcome them. The practice of compassion invites us to be less critical and more understanding, both with others and ourselves. And how can you start replacing judgment with understanding in your daily interactions? Compassion and empathy are paths to deeper personal growth. When we practice these virtues, we become more complete people, more connected to the world and others. Stoicism teaches us that by cultivating compassion, we not only help alleviate others' suffering, but also find an internal satisfaction that transcends external circumstances. Are you ready to start practicing more compassion and empathy in your daily life? Now tell me, how have you practiced compassion and empathy? Leave your comment below and share your experiences. But now it's your turn to act. How will you start applying these lessons in your life today? Share your intentions and plans in the comments and let's continue this conversation. Remember to subscribe to the channel and turn on notifications so you don't miss any lessons on stoicism and personal development. Together, we can continue this journey of growth and evolution.